From the media company that brought you WBOC, WRDE, Fox 21, Telemundo Delmarva, Delmarva Life, Outdoors Delmarva, and Chopper 16, plus seven premier radio stations. Draper Media presents the Delmarva Sports Network. Now to give you an exclusive tour of our operations, Zach Parnes, Sports Director of DSN. Hey everyone, I'm Zach Parnes, Sports Director of Delmarva Sports Network. I'm really excited to show you guys what our brand new set looks like. But before we get there, we gotta check out the control room because after all, that's where all the magic happens. Now, Sean here is our director. He's going to be sliding over from WBOC and has been with Draper Media since May of 2019. And the man to his left, our producer, Alex Brownstein, he's been keeping us all in line and is also sliding over from WBOC where he was a news producer. Alex has been with us since March of last year. All right, thank you, gentlemen. But of course, now it's time for the main event. First and foremost, we're gonna talk about these walls over here and how we're gonna use them. We gotta meet our camera person and truck operator first, Tyrone Sharper. Tyrone comes to us from Temple University and prior to being at DSN, he actually works for the Philadelphia Eagles. And yes, he has that coveted Super Bowl ring. Now, in just a second, we're gonna meet the rest of our amazing team, Corey, Kayla, and Lorencia. They're gonna tell you guys how this set is gonna be used. Now, this is what we call our stadium wall and we'll deliver a game highlight from here. Now the picture behind me will change to reflect multiple sports throughout the season. Now soon we'll have a picture of the gymnasium, and after that we'll have a picture of a baseball field in the spring. Now here's Corey to tell you more about our set. Thanks Lorencia. This is our great wall of sports. Sorry for the pun. We're going to keep things going here. Once we launch, we will air a 30-minute live sports wrap-up twice each weeknight called The Final Score. This is where we'll start each show, and we really love the arch, which we feel really gives it some character. As you can see, we've got some great items from the various schools on Delmarva, with even more to come. We plan to freshen up the set each quarter by changing some of these items out. And now, I'm going to throw it over to Kayla to take you through the final wall. Thanks, Corey. This is our locker room setting where we'll have interviews with players and coaches. As you can see, we have jerseys of Mr. Draper and the numbers that he wore during his college playing days. Plus, we have tributes of the founder all over our set and pictures of him during the glory days. Back to you, Zach. Let's get a look at our transmitter tower in Laurel from Chopper 16. Not only does our transmitter tower provide programming to over half a million viewers on Delmarva, but we've utilized the tower space to enhance the DSN live coverage experience. At 650 feet in the sky, there are two dishes to create a high-speed, bi-directional link from the transmitter to the DSN control room in Salisbury. The dual dish provides redundancy for our signal. Moving on up to 850 feet in the sky, there are six panels that provide a high-speed bi-directional link to the DSN production truck. Because of those advanced panels, the DSN truck can travel virtually anywhere on the peninsula and allows us to send audio and video back to our control room. It also allows the control room to send programming back to the truck. And of course, to maintain consistency with our viewers, there's plenty of redundancies in place. At DSN, we'll focus on covering both Maryland's Bayside and Delaware's Henlopen High School conferences. We'll also have broadcast agreements with Delaware State University, Salisbury University, the University of Maryland Eastern Shore, and Delaware Technical and Community College. Plus, we'll cover minor league teams including both the Delmarva Shorebirds and Wilmington Blue Rocks, the Delaware Blue Coats basketball, and Delaware Thunder hockey. Growing up in Delmar, I wrestled and played football. I know how passionate people here on Delmarva are when it comes to local sports. We've made the conscious decision to cover high school sports in a unique way. We won't be critiquing high school coaches and officials, and we won't focus on anything negative that happens on the field. Our coverage will be positive and uplifting. Here's more from Lorencia, Corey, and Kayla of the DSN team. Every weeknight, we'll broadcast the Final Score Sportscast at both 7.30 and 10.30. Plus, we'll have new games five to six nights a week. This will forever change how local high school sports are covered. We'll cover the competition from every angle and provide viewers with instant replay, slow motion, and network quality graphics. It's local sports like you've never seen. The games on DSN will not just be football and boys and girls basketball. We'll have you covered for softball, 
field hockey, boys and girls soccer, and volleyball, just to name a few. We have more than 500 episodes of Outdoors Del Marva shows to reshare. We're also working with local tracks to cover motorsports and plan to be at other events such as the Dewey Beach Skimboarding Competition and of course, the White Marlin Open. Of course, local sports is our forte, but DSN is much more than a local sports channel. We produce sports programming like the NFL special seen in early September. And we supply sports coverage for the newscasts of our CBS, NBC, and Fox stations. Plus, we'll provide sports updates on our seven Draper Media radio stations. The Delmarva Sports Network, covering local teams with big dreams.